Hey guys, so in my last video, I did how I imagine Sandstorm would look, and in the video before that, I did how I imagine Firestorm would look. So for part three, it's going to be kind of a special. Like I said in the last video, I want to do their kits, how I thought they would look based on me, not the book. Like just my opinion on how I thought they would look. So, you know, let's hope this turns out pretty good, because if not, I might cry. <laughs> so first off, we're going to keep their names the same. But we're going to start off with Squirrel Flight. Hold up. Yeah, let me get that nice ginger color from Firestar. And then let's make it a little bit darker. And let's put it on Squirrel Flight. Um, that's not as red as I would like it to be. Let's change this over here to a little bit more red. Just make it down a little bit darker than that. Yeah, that's a good color. Okay. So this looks pretty good so far, I feel like. Sorry, I got a Tootsie Roll Pop, and I decided I was going to eat it right before I started making my video. <laughs> Alright, so, we're going to start off with the eyes, like we almost always do. Like we always do. I want to freestyle it, and I'm going to make it kind of... Yeah, this color looks... That color, yes. It's beautiful. Ooh, what am I on? I'm sorry, I struggled to draw with one hand on the computer, so this is my solution. I might not talk a whole lot in this video just because I decided to eat a two year old pop in the middle of my video. How smart. Okay, let's see what we got this done. Okay, we got that done. Dang, squirrel fight works some thick mascara. Okay, and No, I'm being quiet. I'm sorry. Mm. Let's go back to these eyebrows and fix them up real fast. Let me set this down on a gum wrapper and wrap it up real fast. Don't mm, ask why I have a random gum wrapper just laying in my room. Don't ask. I do normally need something to do in my mouth, though. So, like, can I get my gum? Okay. Right. So let's go over here to this nice um yeah, that's a nice color. Alright. Dang it. We're just gonna go to here. I don't know what I did, but I totally did something wrong. And now it's too white. Okay, yeah, that's better. Now let's take our black tool back in and, um... Probably need to be reading, but like, let's just make a video.
All right, fill it in. All right, let's see. Not done with that. There we go. Let's just darken these. Let's go fast. Um, yep. Fill that in and then take this and go over the edges. Now that I got that done, we can move on to other parts of her body. So I do kind of want her to look a lot like Firestar, but at the same time, like, ooh, I didn't even realize that I actually left that white, but it looks good because, you know, she does have one white paw. I know I'm not supposed to be going based off the book, but I do want to leave that one little detail in there because I think, personally, I think that's one of her best, most, uh, that's one of the things I really like about her. My favorite cat in the Warrior Cat series is River Ripple from Dawn of the Clans. He is the first leader of River Clan, and he's just a really calm cat in general, and I think he's really, like, cool, so. Then again, I have always really just liked water, so. I don't really like this actually. I'm gonna change this. Okay, I know the lines are like super blotchy and I really hate how that is, but what can we do? Honestly, I probably would have named her Fox Paul or Fox Flight because I just love foxes and otters. So, like I said, I really like rivers. I also like forests and stuff a lot, so. You know, if I was Aaron Hunter, her name, well, Aaron, if I was one of the Aarons, because, you know, Aaron Hunter is an actual real person. I'm sure there's a person out there named Aaron Hunter, but the person, it's just a bunch of different people. And one of them I have read her books. I'm pretty sure her name's 2T something, and uh, she, I think she wrote the Wings of Fire series, and I've read quite a few of those, and I lost the book, so. I think I'm on the fourth book in that series. It's a good series, too. gonna make this a tiny bit lighter and take it and go like that yeah I've always like cats with like multicolored tails yay manually coloring I love manually coloring stripes totally love it all right let's see let's get that in there can I fill it in now no, I can't actually. Right, let's go back to manually coloring it then. <laughs> I sound so like depressed. I feel like I'm not. I'm not. Trust me, I'm not. Don't be depressed. It just makes you sadder than you already are. Alright, and then. We're gonna go for a slightly darker tone. Nope, never mind. I like that, honestly. She looks so mad. I think that we're done with Squirrel Flight. I might come back through and do some touch-ups, but I've already spent like nine minutes on her. And so, the fact is, it's just taking so long. So, let's go ahead and, and give her some text right here. Squirrel Flight. I'll make it smaller. You 
would think for someone who tries to write books that I would have that would be able to spell something, but no, actually I can't. So, Sandstorm is sort of, for me, right here, is sort of ginger and sort of brownish. So we're going to take her color, and we're going to make it more into this color, like more of a brown color. That's the color we're going to use for leaf pool. See, it is pretty brown, and it does look like sort of how I imagine leaf pool would look. But at the same time, it isn't. And see, these two are darker, and these two are lighter. Even though, let me full honestly, I kind of want you to be a little bit more orange, girl. I'm sorry. I want an orange family. Ooh, that's too ooh. I mean, it would make it more possible for lion boys. Hey! What's wrong, Nebby? Wanna come up here with me? Nebby's being a turd. Oh, dang it. Okay, we're gonna change it to this. How does this look? Actually, I think that is a wonderful color for her. Now that we've got that done. Wait a minute, did we? Yeah, we did that, okay. I was just double checking, I have to make sure I did leave full, uh, not leave full, squirrel flight's eyes. So yes, since I did make leaf pool and uh, I make sort of like a mix of, girl, I can't even move my stool because of you. I did make her color a little bit of a mix between Firestar and Sandstorm. But hear me out, it's only because I thought it would be cute. It's not quite as orange as Firestar's, but it's oranger than Sandstorm's. But Sandstorm is a sandy cat, so, you know, she's supposed to look like sand, so I feel like hers matches hers. Speaking of sand, I'm going to the beach soon. I think. I don't think I was supposed to know. Okay, let's see. And now, let's just take this. Yes, you beautiful creature. So, Firestar was our first one, and let's see who looks better. Firestar or Leaf Pool. I mean, not Leaf Pool. Sandstorm. Hmm. I think Sandstorm looks better. Hey, no, 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 no. You can't step on this. I love you. I, lo I do love you. Yes, I do. Oh, I love you so much. She's so sleepy. You been asleep? Have you been asleep? Nebby's been asleep. No, don't kiss me. I mean, I love your kisses, but don't kiss me on the lips. You want to say hi? Nebby, look up. Look up. Oh, she don't want to be on the camera. Are you camera shy? She's camera shy. <laughs> okay, now that we've shown Nebby, let's get back to leaf pool. So now we can make her eyes. I want them to be kind of light green like her mom's, but also kind of like dark green like her dad's. So we've got a mostly dark green eyed family, and Firestar's eyes are super dark. Hers are definitely lighter than Firestar's. Definitely lighter than Squirrel Fights. I mean, if you look at it, yeah, definitely lighter. But I want them to be um, a little bit lighter. So, like, yeah, that's cute. That's a cute color. Oh, no. We don't need some green eyeliner. No, no, no. You just don't want to work out, do you, Leafful? No, you don't. So me and my younger brother did a drawing challenge, but he said both of our ages in the video, so I'm sorry that I can't post that. It was like 20 minutes long anyways. This video is going to be too, because I won't actually focus on the cat. So anyways, 
I'm going to ask y'all some questions, and I don't think the comments are turned on, but, like, um, I'm going to try to get the comments turned on so y'all can answer my questions. Would you rather eat a mouse or eat cat food? Um, okay. Now that you've had some time to think about that, I'm going to fall over. Would you rather fall off a cliff and break your legs and never be able to walk again? Or, this video is going to get demonetized, bro. Or would you rather, hmm, fall off a building Fall off a 100 foot diving board and land in water and break your arm and never be able to write again. Okay, now that you have time to think about that. Next, would you rather is gonna be. Would you rather draw or read? Okay. Giving you a little bit of time to think about that. For me, it's probably both. Honestly, I'd rather I'd probably prefer to write over both of those because I just like writing. I have a really creative mind. Sometimes, I mean, sometimes I don't. You're so cute. She's got to be so cute. Okay, bro, calm down. We're about done with leaf pool. She looks honestly. I think she's cute. Not in a weird way. I just think she's cute. See, her edges turned out way less blotchy than Squirrel Flight. Squirrel Flight is really red. Okay, and let's just add some like finishing touches on her. Let's give her her pink nose. Yeah, you're going to have a really pink nose. You know that, Leaf Flight? I mean... Sorry, I have a tendency to mix up their names, and I do it on purpose normally. Sometimes I do it on accident, but normally it's pretty much on purpose. So, yeah. Leaf Flight, honestly, would be a pretty cute name. Okay, oh no, let's go in and neaten that up. Alright, now that that's neatened up, let's take our black and give her eyebrows a fix. Now that we've fixed her eyebrows up. Take this and then just kind of make those a little bit more orange so it doesn't look as bad. So, I mean, if I was doing it genetically accurate, Squirrel Flight would still probably be able to be a little bit gingerish because of Leaf Full, but I mean, not Leaf Full because of um, Sandstorm, but Firestar would not be a ginger cat. I hope you know that. Alright, let's get this just neatened up a little bit. Yeah. Let's just take the black, fix that up. And then... We can't have like any white spaces. Right, and then, but I'm trying to zoom out. And I want to give Leaf Pool some of her mother's characteristics. And 
And so, first of all, we're going to give her this beautiful white chest. Beautiful. Fill that in. Take our paintbrush. Just go over all these edges like this. Yep. Navi, you going to take a nap back there? Are you doing, Nebula? She says, what are you doing, human? I'm drawing for a video. Yep, this video, like I said, is already 20 minutes long. Okay, now that we got that done. I kind of want to give her some, like, white on the tip of her tail. Because almost the entire family has that. I think Sandstorm might be the only. Nope, nope, everyone does have that. And everyone except for... No, everyone does have stripes. Squirrel Flat has a, that one stripe on her tail. Girl, what are you doing? Why are you staring at my computer? Let's see. Let's draw ourselves. And I want Leaf Pools to be kind of extra big. What is it, Nebby? Oh, I know you love me. I'm your favorite. Yeah, I am your favorite, aren't I? No, 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 no. Nebula, you need to calm yourself, child. We're gonna give her some. Stop. Why does it keep doing this? This cat is pretty crazy. No, no, that's my blanket. Nebby. You know that one day, Nebby's, nobody's going to think you're that cute anymore. And then you're going to be in big trouble. Because you're a turd. You're so spoiled. Stop. 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 I just said stop. Can you not, please? Thank you. No, go. Stay away. Nobody likes you. Nebby, no. Can you go back to sleep and be cute again? <sighs> no. 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 Stop. She says, I will make you sab I will sabotage. Save your work so your kitten doesn't destroy it. That's the life lesson for today, kids. Okay, well, now that we got that done, I can erase this. Switch that over to black and real fast. Just make that nice and neat looking. Yep. Let's go over these outer edge lines just to make it look better. I'm just trying to neaten up the edges because I know I messed up on them a lot. So, Nabby, I see you getting ready to attack my hand. Stop, Nebula. She's going to destroy my blanket, and then I'm going to destroy her. You want to get destroyed, Nebula? Do you? I know you do. What? What's my hand doing, Nebby? Does it bother you that my hand's moving? <laughs> okay. 
So, I believe this is where we are going to end the video. Let me just get Leaf Pull's name right here. There's not drastic changes in the family, except Leaf Pull's got some tabby stripes now. Squirrel Flight has a light ginger spot on her tail. Actually, you know what? I do want to add some, like, I want to go to this color back here. I just want to add some of these around here. Like, add one down on her paw. Um, no, I want to go over to Squirrel Fly. Squirrel Fly. Squirrel Fly. Squirrel Fly. Squirrel Fly. Can I work on Squirrel Fly? Yay, I can. Let's go back to here, anyways. So she's gonna have some light ginger toes. I like this new design that I've made for her. At this point, I'm just kind of designing them how I want them to, adding some new spots and stuff. Yo, Aaron, if you ever decide to make any more books, I can I can draw you up some characters. No, I can't. Don't actually ask me to because I suck at drawing. I can color you some characters. Maybe I can actually. I don't know what this is supposed to be, but you know. It looks fine. What is it, Navi? What's wrong? Alright, so now that we got, oh no, honestly it kind of looks fine, so. And you know what has to be added to Squirrel Fight now? Of course, we gotta give her a white chest. Just like that, yep. If I fill it in, will it take away that splotch? It will, hooray. It's fine, I can redo the splotch. Anyways, now I can like go to this nice, lovely color. Just kind of turn it into this. You know what, I wanna make it light. I'm just making myself have more work to do. How lovely. It's, I mean, I've got all day, so. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Nebby looked at me like, are you feeling mentally stable, human? Okay, I know. I'm staring, like, intensely at my computer right now, trying to figure out how to make this look neater. So now that we've got that done, Squirrel Flight's got some extras, and Firestar looks a lot more different than her now. But I do like the designs overall, and I'm going to leave you at almost a 30 minute long video. Nebby, you got anything you want to say? No, you just want to lick my finger? You're so weird. Alright, let's go up here fast, just add this. We'll move it down to 15. Fire Stars Family. Good. Hold up. All right, and actually.
how lovely. There's just so many words. Actually, you know what? Let's undo this last three things. And we're going to put it in here. Okay, there we go. You know what? Of course, now we've got to go through here and fix leaf pulls and move hers down some. Because that's just how I am. Hold up. This video is so much longer than I wanted it to be. Okay. There we go. And that's it. Thank you for watching, guys. Have a great day.